Aziz ve ümmetli beyler, hanımlar, Ontario Parlamentine çok hoş gelmişsiniz. <gülüyor> Merhaba, günaydın. Salamlar olsun sizlere. Uh, it's a great pleasure and honor and privilege uh, to uh, to be an honorary host of this event. This is the fourth event uh, the Anatolian Heritage Federation is uh, holding uh, at, at Queen's Park. But before starting my remarks, I would like to acknowledge my colleagues who are here uh, today with us. MPP Sherry Donova, MPP Monty Quinter, MPP Jack McLaren, uh, the Honorable Yasser Nakfi, MPP John Otur, MPP uh, Dr. Sh uh, Dr. Shafiq Qadri, uh, MPP uh, Tracy McCharles, the Honorable McCharles, Honorable Mario uh, Sergio, MPP uh, Depica Namrella, MPP uh, Laura Albanese and MPP Todd Smith. If I've missed anybody, please. Oh, yes. MPP uh, Franz Jelena, MPP uh, Jerry Walid. And there are many other MPPs who couldn't be here, but they are here spiritually with us. So please give them a big round of applause. I commend the Anatolian Heritage Federation for organizing this event, as I mentioned earlier. This is the fourth time they have been doing this. And with this wonderful uh, uh, video display, which uh, we just saw a few minutes ago, uh, this shows how Canada and Turkey have made very many similarities in terms of its uh, diversity, in terms of recognizing the diverse communities and the Turkish people as we learned on the video and also in remarks by Azim, uh, it's, Turkish people not only live in, in Turkey, but they live in at least 10, 12 other countries around the world, mainly in Central Asia. And even if you travel Central Asia, you will always uh, hear uh, Turkish language spoken by very many other groups, including in Kazakhstan, in Turkmenistan, in Tajikistan, in Kyrgyzstan, in eastern part of China, and uh, in Tataristan, we hear these days about Tatar peoples of Crimea. They're also Turkic people. So Turkish culture and tradition and language goes on a uh, long, long way in Central Asia from, uh, uh, from the borders of Europe to, uh, to the borders of, of China. The Federation has been doing a great job over the years in terms of bringing the, uh, not only Turkish culture to Canada and introducing the Turkish tradition, Turkish culture, but also trying to build bridges between Canadian culture and the Turkish culture. And by Canadian culture, I mean the culture of all the people of Canada. And the, one of the great things they do is they invite people to visit Turkey. And that is an excellent uh, initiative where people go to Turkey and have a visit, see the place, see the country, uh, get to know the culture. Every year, as you know, uh, there are about, I believe, 90 million people visit Turkey. Turkey is one of the uh, one of the top destinations for tourists around the world. But having people from Canada, particularly the decision makers, politicians, and others to visit Turkey, I think it, it could be, and it, it has been very helpful uh, for, for Turkey and for Canada, and as well as to uh, Canadian, Canadians of Turkish heritage and other Canadians. Uh, Turkey is now sixth largest economy in Europe and 17th largest economy in the world. I have traveled many, many times in Turkey and I have seen firsthand how Turkey has uh, developed over the past maybe 20, 25 years. Uh, Turkey has come a long way and uh, it is in the, the country is in the right path for progress, for growth. And I wish that um, uh, in, in the many years to come, a collaboration between Turkey and Canada will flourish. And I think the, uh, the Turkish community of Canada plays a very, very important role in uh, fostering economic, uh, economical and also cultural relationship between uh, Canada and Turkey. So I want to thank everyone, in particular uh, the Anatolian Heritage Foundation and the 21 uh, Turkish association across the country, which are, are within the umbrella of the Federation. I want to thank you all for uh, organizing this event and the similar events as you do uh, during the year to uh, educate us about the Turkish culture and also bringing, uh, building bridges between the Turkish community, the Turkish culture, and other cultures 
in, in Canada. So thank you very much, and I thank my colleagues for their presence here and the guests as well. Thank you.